Maybe you're seeing the last little snow here. It's late March. Anyway, in this video, those of you who need it, will I'll take you step by step through the first part of Water Fairies, the first two sections. They're very easy. You've already learned the hard part. If you've already learned all of Water Fairies, then you can skip to the next video. But this will take you by the hand, those of you that need it, so that you'll be all finished and you can play Water Fairies. So since we're going backwards, here's section two of Water Fairies. And that's it. Okay, so you've got one G little tail, then a G big tail. You move the whole contraption down to the F little tail. F big tail. That's section two. So you also want to connect the two sections, to connect two to three, and for that you want to practice your eyeball placing to make it smooth. So the end of section two is section three starts with. So that means that when I place these hands here uh, for the last bit of section two, this uh, big tail, the F big tail, all of a sudden my eyes go boom, bouncing down to this F where I'm headed. And I can actually move down there while the right hand is finishing its little job. this because you place here you still have time to look over to here your eyeball bounces over here while you're playing this and you know the rest and finally here's section one it'll sound like this And then it goes into section two. Again, four C little tails and four C big tails. And repeat that whole pattern again. Four C little tails and four C big tails. Now you're going to move everything up a notch and do your D little tails, four of those, and four D big tails, and repeat it. And that's section one. Connect that by planning your eyeball placing and practicing it. So I'm ending up this section with, and I want to go down to this. So I'm, I'm going to plan that as soon as I put my hand here, I'm going to practice having my eyeball bounce to there. And it's a different hand shape, so you're doing 
the, the big tail hand shape here. And as you move down, your hand shape changes to the little hand, little tail. Now that you can combine sections one and two, I'll play it together with you very slowly. Left hand is leading here. So you've got both hands on a C triad little tail. And get ready for a C big tail. Get ready for a C little tail. Ready for a C big tail? Get ready for a D little tail. Get ready for a D big tail. Ready for a D little tail. Get ready for a D big tail. That was section one. We we'll go to section two. It starts with an F because you've got a G little tail. And now a G big tail. Little tail, F big tail, and then you'll go into the rest of the tune. So that's it for learning water fairies. In the next video, you're going to learn some things to make all of your playing easier.